That guy just yelled out his car window, ha ha, look at all these effing losers, why don't you get a job, you should be working today. And then he said something, something illegal, illegal. Oh, and he also had a U.S. Imperial flag, like an American flag, hanging from his rearview mirror. So one thing I didn't talk about on camera, um, earlier I was going to mention, while oh, we were still at the church, but I was slipping my mind, was that uh, there was a code of conduct they expected everyone to sign before participating for volunteering, and they asked everyone to bring a yellow vest. They had extra yellow vests, but um, yeah, they asked people to either bring it or send it in digitally. Uh, this form that says, like, you won't interact with people that are trying to be disruptive or critical of the march, and not to, uh, it said something along the lines of not to return uh, violence, return violent speech with violent speech or something, and it said no threats, like, no threatening gestures, no profanity. Um, it also advised people not to run, no running. So there was like a few things in the code of conduct they made everyone sign. I thought it was kind of relevant to that guy back there yelling. Um, when I marched in Florida, there were a few people actually like protesting it with like signs, like some FU signs and things like that. And I noticed that those marches, uh, the CIW always had marshals that would like stand near them and just be waving people along, like just go past and don't interact with them, which I think is kind of funny. Because like in, in some ways I would like to interact with some of those people, but. Um, like ask them questions about why they feel that way, but I get why they don't want there to be any incidents, so to speak.